Welcome back to Infigyan friends. Today in this video we have one very very interesting radical equation problem which we will be solving. So let's get started. I will subtract 2 from both the sides. So we will write minus 2 in RHS also. So 4 minus 2 is 2. We will write 2 plus fifth root of x minus 2 whole power 5 minus 82 equal to x minus 2. Now we have x minus 2 on both the sides. So let us assume x minus 2 equal to a. So our equation will become 2 plus fifth root of a power 5 minus 82 equal to a. Now I will take minus common from this radicand and we can write 2 minus fifth root of 82 minus a power 5 equal to a. Now we will take this term to the RHS and we can write our equation a plus fifth root of 82 minus a power 5 equal to 2. Let me write our equation here. Now we will use our substitution. Let's say this radicant equal to b power 5. So we can write our equation after this substitution. a plus fifth root of b power 5 is b equal to 2. This is our equation number 1. And from this substitution I can write 82 minus a power 5. This is equal to our substitution b power 5 or we can write a power 5 plus b power 5 will be equal to 82. This is our equation number 2. Now I will use one algebraic formula. So I will write here a cube plus b cube. This is equal to a plus b whole cube minus 3ab times a plus b. So we will calculate a cube plus b cube. Now a plus b is equation number 1, it is 2. So I will write 2 cube minus 3 times ab, a plus b is 2. So we can write here 8 minus 6ab or we can take 2 common. In the bracket, we can write 4 minus 3ab. This equation we will call equation number 3. Let us utilize all the three equations. I will write here binomial expansion for a plus b whole power 5. This is equal to a power 5 plus b power 5 plus 5ab. In the bracket, a cube plus b cube plus 10 times a square b square times a plus b. Now if I will write our equations, then a plus b was 2, a power 5 plus b power 5. This was equal to 82, equation number 2. Then we can write a cube plus b cube value. This is equal to 2 is common in the bracket 4 minus 3 times ab. Let's apply all the values. So I can write LHS a plus b whole power 5. So I will be writing 2 power 5 equal to a power 5 plus b power 5 82 plus 5 times ab times a cube plus b cube. It is 2 times 4 minus 3ab plus 10 times a square b square. a plus b is 2. Now we can divide our equation by 2. So let's divide both sides by 2. So 
we will cancel 2 from numerator and denominator. Here we will write 41. Here we will cancel power. So this will be 2 power 4 in LHS. I can write 2 power 4 equal to 16 equal to 41 plus 5AB times 4, 20AB. 5AB times minus 3AB. So I will write minus 15A square B square. Then we have 10A square B square. Now I will take all the terms to LHS. And this value we will consider minus 5A square B square. So I can write equation 5A square B square minus 20AB. 16 minus 41 is 25 with negative sign equal to 0. Now equation is divisible by 5. We will get A square B square minus 4AB minus 5 equal to 0. minus 4ab minus 5 equal to 0. Now we can see the factors of 5, 5 times 1. Then we can split our minus 4ab middle term as minus 5ab plus ab. So we will get factors ab plus 1 times ab minus 5 equal to 0. From product 0 rule, we will be getting AB equal to negative 1 and AB equal to 5. If I will write separately AB equal to negative 1 and AB equal to 5. Now our first equation was A plus B equal to 2. So from here I can write B equal to 2 minus A. Let's apply a times 2 minus a equal to minus 1. A times 2 minus a equal to 5. So 2a minus a square equal to negative 1. Or we can write a square minus 2a minus 1 equal to 0. This is our quadratic equation. Now let us take this equation also 2a minus a square equal to 5, a square minus 2a plus 5 equal to 0. So we have two quadratic equations which we will solve one by one. Let me write a square minus 2a minus 1 equal to 0. Minus 2a minus 1 equal to 0. We will apply quadratic formula. As per formula, minus b plus minus the square root of b square minus 4ac divided by 2 times a. As per our equation, a is 1, b is negative 2, c is minus 1. Let's apply the values. So I will write 2 plus minus the square root of minus 2 square is 4 minus 4 times 1 times negative 1 over 2 times 1 is 2 will be equal to 2 plus minus the square root of 4 plus 4 over 2. This will be equal to 2 plus minus the square root 8 over 2. Now square root 8 we can write 2 root 2 over 2. So we will be getting a equal to 1 plus minus a square root. Now we will consider our second equation a square minus 2a plus 5 equal to 0 a square minus 2a plus 5 equal to 0. Let's use quadratic formula once again. Minus b. So minus of minus 2 plus 2 plus minus. The square root of minus 2 square is 4 
minus 4ac will give us minus 20 over 2 times 1 is 2. So I can write 2 plus minus the square root of negative 16 over 2. This will be equal to 2 plus minus the square root of negative 1 times the square root of 16 over 2. Now we know that the square root of minus 1 is i. So we will be writing here 2 plus minus 4i over 2. Or we can write a will be equal to 1 plus minus 2i. This is the value of a which is complex. So I will write here a equal to 1 plus minus square root 2. And two complex solutions were there. 1 plus minus 2i. Now a was our substitution. So if I will write x minus 2 was our substitution a. So in place of a we can write x minus 2 equal to 1 plus minus square root 2 and 1 plus minus 2i. Now we will add 2 to both sides. So we will write here plus 2 plus 2 and plus 2. So LHS will be our required variable x. RHS will be 3 plus minus square root 2 the real values and 2 complex value will be 3 plus minus 2i. So our final answer is 3 plus minus root 2 real solutions and 3 plus minus 2i complex solutions. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to subscribe our channel. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Bye bye.